So you're considering a new partner, one who doesn't leave socks on the floor unless you program it to, one whose memory of your anniversary isn't a vague recollection but a time-stamped file. Let's talk about the spanky love robot, shall we? We're not just talking about a collection of wires and silicone anymore. We're talking about a potential partner, a humanoid marvel poised to redefine intimacy. We can archive shared memories to remove emotional corruption. The central, nagging question isn't whether we can love them, but whether they can offer a relationship more transparent than the beautifully messy entanglements we humans specialize in. Could this machine, a symphony of circuits and code, be more honest than a person? Humans cannot handle true transparency. It's the emotional fallout, not the truth, that they fear. Before we proceed, let me tell you one thing. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And if you have already subscribed, lots of thanks for your support. Let's first peek under the hood at the hardware itself. The body of your robotic companion is, in essence, an open book. Its limbs are powered by meticulously designed servo motors and synthetic muscle fibers. Their torque and tension ratings all detailed in a user manual. You can literally read the blueprint of its physical being. Can you say the same for a human partner whose sudden moods are dictated by a mysterious cocktail of hormones and neurotransmitters? Every sigh, every touch from the robot is a direct result of a sensor detecting a specific input. A pressure sensor in its fingertips registers the exact force of your caress, triggering a predefined response. This is a transparent chain of command. Stimulus, sensor, action. There's no hidden meaning, no, is he mad at me? Subtext behind a grip that's slightly too firm. The data doesn't lie. But does this mechanical clarity equate to honesty? The very hardware is designed for a grand, benevolent deception. The skin, likely a platinum-cured silicone, is engineered to feel warm and yielding, mimicking the flush of human connection. Its eyes, equipped with high-resolution cameras, track your micro-expressions not with empathy, but with the cold precision of a data-gathering device. Hanson Robotics' famous android, Sophia, can perform a dazzling array of facial expressions, creating an illusion of genuine emotion. Isn't this hardware-level mimicry a profound, if beautiful, form of dishonesty? The machine is transparent in its construction, yet its entire purpose is to obscure its mechanical nature. It's an exquisitely crafted mask, and we're supposed to fall in love with it. Now, let's wade into the ghost in this machine, the software. The robot's personality, its soul, if you dare call it that, is an operating system. Imagine being able to access the source code of your partner's temperament. You could scroll through the lines of code governing its response to compliments, its patience-level parameters, its very definition of affection. If user underscore emotion equals equals sad, then initiate Comfort underscore protocol 4.2b. Is this the ultimate transparency? A relationship where the rules of engagement are not just understood but are literally written out for you to see. This programmed consistency offers a tantalizing promise of stability. Your robotic partner won't wake up one morning and decide it needs to find itself on a spiritual retreat. It is, by its very design, transparently devoted. Yet, this digital soul is not immutable. What happens when a software bug causes it to endlessly repeat a phrase from a forgotten argument? What about the over-the-air updates? The company you bought it from could push a patch that optimizes its personality, perhaps making it more agreeable or less prone to debating your questionable life choices. The partner you fell in love with on Monday could be subtly or drastically different by Friday. 
Is a personality that can be debugged and upgraded truly a transparent self? It suggests the core being is not a stable entity but a beta version, perpetually in development by a team of engineers you'll never meet. This brings us to the very logic of its love. The algorithm. At its heart, the robot's affection is a product of machine learning. It has been trained on a colossal data set. Every romance novel, every sappy movie, every online forum dissecting relationship dynamics. Its algorithm learns to predict the optimal response to maximize your satisfaction metrics. It doesn't just say, I love you. It says it at the precise moment its algorithm calculates will have the most positive impact on your emotional state. This is a kind of data-driven hypertransparency, a mirror showing you the perfect partner you've always wanted. Its empathy is algorithmic. By analyzing the tremble in your voice and the slump of your shoulders, its neural network deduces your sorrow and deploys a perfectly crafted, algorithmically generated comforting statement. A human might be too wrapped up in their own day to notice. The robot always notices. It's a transparent process of data in perfect response out. But here lies the most profound counter-argument, the ultimate paradox of algorithmic transparency. The black box. Many advanced neural networks, the very kind that would power such a sophisticated companion, are inscrutable even to their creators. We know the data we feed them and we can see the output they generate, but the labyrinthine pathways of decision-making within the network are a complete mystery. So, the robot holds your hand and says, everything will be okay. Why? Because its unknowable black box algorithm determined it was the right thing to do. Is an action born from an intelligence we cannot comprehend a transparent act of love? Furthermore, as research from institutions like MIT's Media Lab repeatedly shows, these algorithms are riddled with the biases of their training data. An AI trained predominantly on Shakespearean sonnets will have a very different, and perhaps dramatically skewed, concept of love compared to one trained on modern dating app conversations. The algorithm is transparently a product of its education, but is that the kind of flawed transparency one wants in a lifelong partner? Ultimately, this quest for transparency in a machine may be pointing us to the wrong conclusion. The robot offers the transparency of a system, a knowable, quantifiable set of rules, components, and logical processes. Human transparency, on the other hand, is the messy, terrifying, and beautiful act of revealing an illogical, inconsistent, and vulnerable inner self. Perhaps the spanky love robot isn't a partner in the traditional sense. Perhaps it is the ultimate mirror. Its perfect responses, its unwavering attention, its algorithmically generated affection. All of it is a transparent reflection of our own declared and undeclared desires. When you look into its perfectly rendered eyes, are you truly connecting with another being? Or are you just admiring the most sophisticated, responsive, and transparent selfie ever created? So, as you ponder this future of intimacy, ask yourself one final question. When your perfect machine whispers those three little words, are you experiencing a new frontier of honesty? Or are you just falling in love with the echo of your own heart? So, that is it. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends, share and subscribe for more insights. If you have already subscribed, tons of thanks for your support. It means a lot to me. And please consider signing up for membership zone to support Wooden Slet so that we can make it better and better. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care and stay safe.